So welcome back to the channel. Another forest career mode. We've got Bolton Wanderers in this one. There you see the team. We're gonna jump straight into this. So let's see if we can pick up another win. I have got some new sliders in this one. Um, just testing out, you know, some some different ones. Let's see if we can make any difference. There we are. Bolton Wanderers. FA Cup. Bolton Wanderers line up as follows. Number one, Ben. Oldwick, number 31, David Wheater. Thank you. Enjoy the game. So here's where the competition starts taking shape. Really starts heating up from here. And hopefully we can see off Bolton Wanderers in this one. This is a competition we would desperately like to go far in. Forest would definitely be the underdogs, but we are in the final of the Carabao Cup, which will be happening not too long away. We do have Manchester United in the final of that. There's João Carvalho on a good run here. João Carvalho, oh, that was going in. That was going in for sure. Good run though from Carvalho. Nice early shot. Really should have made more of it, but great blocking on the goal line. Here is Lewis Graben. Corner kick. Went for a cross, blocked away. Diaz. It's a cross in. Nothing comes of it. Ostuma. Amiobi. And Fox will get to that one. Passes off to Pantelimon. It's Janko. It's Carvalho. Finds Jack Cole back. Grabbing down to Diogo Gongalvez. Is he going to make a run? No, he gets tackled out wide. Here is Amiobi. Cole back. Tried to do something a little different there. Didn't pay off for him. Forrest win it back. Gil Diaz. With the owner of the blue car parked outside reception, please move it immediately. Thank you. It's too much. Will shut. There's Will shut. He's coming forward. He's coming forward. Oh. Headed away for a corner. And that was good from Heffley. Rosewell got his head to it. Defended excellently. As Will Shaw again. Another decent ball in off the post from Amiobi. Oh. Is that Sammy Amiobi? Decent try though. What a header. Unfortunate for Bolton not to take the lead there. There was a Costa. Back to Acosta. And find goal Galvez. It's Beavers. Nanzik. Oh. It's Ostuma. It's well shot. Blocked by Colback. They still have the ball. Here they come again. And Watson clears his lines. Graben looking for Gon Galvez, couldn't find him though. And pretty much 
all Bolton in the opening 27 minutes. Good block there. Janko. This team is going to whip one in. And Wolf Short didn't really make anything happen with that. It's called Galvez. Watson has found an opening here for Lewis Graben. He's got pressure on him though. Good shot. Good save from Alnwick. He's all on his own, but he felt the pressure of the defenders. Coming up slightly behind him. Diaz. Decent corner. Oh, it's in again. Oh, grabbing straight at Alnwick. For an easy save. Callback. Rises well. Graben. No. Not today. Amiobi. It's Tuma. Finds Amiobi again. Good block from Acosta. It's Amiobi. Oh! That could have been costly for Forrest. Diaz. Not the best first touch from him. And back to Amiobi again. Bolton just running this show. And Acosta with the touch takes that away. These sliders have definitely made it a little bit more difficult though, which I mean, is not a bad thing. Diaz switches the play to Graben. Still running here. It's Jack Colback. Wild shot from him. Didn't need to hit it as hard as he did. He was aiming for that top right hand corner of the net. He wanted to see that bulging. Oh, good play from Acosta just to get that tackle in. Again, Fox does well. It's callback. Ben Watson. Oh, just couldn't get to Graben. Diaz has found the ball again. Oh. Slagenis. Ostuma. Oh, he's looking for Amiobi. He's coming in here. Danilo Acosta has to be careful. That is half time. Goalless at the break. Had some decent chances from both sides. Amiobi, the one coming closest when he hit the right hand post of Forrest's goal. Here we are, second half. Forrest kicking off. What does this second half have in store for either team? Teffoli finds Colback. God, Galvez does well. But he's got a bit of space here. He's going to. Oh, a decent cross. Carvalho coming in at the back stick. Janko meets that well. Not really guided to a player though. That one was. There's Diaz. Diaz coming in. Diaz. Oh. God, Galvez. That went through all the defenders. No one managed to get a touch to it. To the last defender at the back stick. Offside, Amiobi. You've got to just be careful 
of Amiobi, especially with those runs, he's a, he's a fast player. It's gone Galvez. Oh, Galvez. Oh. That, well, that was a weird cross from him. He did just pick up a little bit of a knock from the defender. That's gone out. Bolton throw. There they come again. Ostuma and Jenis. Williams on the ball. He's looking for Wiltshut. That's out from Fox. Back though. Bolton have it back. Not for long. It's gone Galvez. He's looking for the run of Acosta. Finds him. Decent crossing. Oh. Again. Graben. Almost getting his bottom of his foot to that great defending though from Bolton it's a very open game at the moment anyone's game at the moment oh just pushed right over there yeah I'm thinking we need we need to bring someone on a little bit more pace uh Bridcut and possibly Osborne. Hopefully, they can help us out. It's Liam Bridcut just coming on. Diaz though, ooh. Another meaty challenge. Finds Ben Osborne though. He's been in great form as of late. Oh, trying to low cross into the area. That's too much. But Jenis on the ball back to Ostuma again. Oh, Magenis. Oh, blocked away. Be a corner though for Bolton. Forrest just got to watch their backs at the moment. They would hate to go a goal down so late in the game. But it's dealt with. Not the best of balls from Acosta. Janice. Amiobi. He seems to have bundles of pace in his locker. But that was probably one of the worst crosses he's, he's ever done. And Bridcut. Finding Jack Cole back. It's all spawn. Oh, he does pass it through to Acosta. Nothing happening with that. And a lot of crosses in this game. Is this heading for a replay? Surely looks like it at the moment. Oh, come on, Graben. What was that? You've slowed down all the pressure there. Jack Hobbs to Olofsky. Magenis. Oh, Carvalho. Come on, Carvalho. Just pick it up a little. I'm thinking of bringing on Brereton, though, for the last nine minutes. Well, he won't get on straight away. Bring him on right there behind Lewis Graben. It's gone out now. Goal kick. Tumor has come off. 
Because in a way, that's a good thing. Oz Tumor has been, been great today. Oh, it's coming in. Pantillimon, great save. Would hate to go down a goal this late on and lose it. Oof. There's Vela. Will shut. Can't find Janko. Please give a round of applause for today's man of the match, number 15, Luke Murphy. No, no, no. Is that it? Is that game over? Our Forest out with the FA Cup. Look at that for a cross. No chance, Pantillimon. Oh, I think Murphy has just won it. Number 15, Luke Murphy. What a way to lose it right at the end as well. Unless, oh! Gil Diaz! Just when you needed him. Gil Diaz, I'm in shock. I didn't expect that going in whatsoever. Oh my word. Gil Diaz saves Nottingham Forest from an exit in the FA Cup. Listen to the crowd, silent. They thought their team had won. Oh my word. Oh. I, I am in desperate shock now. I think he might have just won us a replay. He has. Oh. The drama. <laughs> wow. That was a tough game. I believe it, it was meant for a draw, but both teams leaving it so late on. Thank you, Diaz. Wow. Let's just have a look at some of the highlights. Amiobi there. Cracking the post. And then, obviously, Luke Murphy. I thought this was it. I was... Look at that. That cross, though, from Amiobi, I told you he could punish us. And he did with that. Probably the best cross of the game, and that was probably earlier on when I said that other cross was terrible. And then just a minute later, Gil Diaz pops up. Brilliant run from him. Off the crossbar and in. I don't think... Anyone expected Forrest to even get another shot in the game, let alone score from it. But he was saving that. He was saving that. Oh, I'm so happy with him. He's definitely playing in the next game. <laughs> wow. So there we have it. Round five, Chelsea just beating Manchester City. One goal to nil. Wolves beating Huddersfield. Bolton and Forest a goal apiece. Stoke beat Watford. Wow. Let's have a look at this. Liverpool smash Southampton. Four goals to one. Sunderland draw with Manchester United, who do have that Carabao Cup final against us in just a few more weeks, I think. West Ham losing out to Brighton. Two goals to one. And Reading have exited. Thanks to Everton. Right. Wow. I'm still in shock after that. After that equaliser. Oh. Let's have a look. Prize money. Yep, yeah, that's going up as well. Look. Hopefully. Um, uh, I suppose we better play him in this one. Just to keep him happy. Then we've got Derby soon as well. That will be in the next episode after this.
happen in this one. We have got Birmingham City. Another difficult team. Let's bring on Iheanacho. Brereton again. I'm going to bring him on subs. Put him on there. Um... I might play Tatsi. This is not played for a while instead of Colback. Who else have we got? I'm going to play Osborne. Diaz is definitely playing. Um, Dawson. I'll play him for Fox. Robinson can play. Yeah, that will be the team. That will be the team. Right. Will there be more drama in this one? <laughs> what a match though what an absolute cracker of a match Inacho smashing them in here I think I'm jinxed every time <laughs> every time I say something like that Ooh, that were a nice one Good save. The shots are like rockets, aren't they? Look at that. Powerful and then well, very powerful. Not good enough though. Let's go. Let's go. Birmingham, bring it on. It's going to be a very difficult game for them. That's the way records. We are up there. We hopefully will enjoy the game. Uh, commentator it's Harding he's going on a run here Nacho back defending but yeah these sliders I, I think have definitely made it a little bit more cagey a little bit more difficult to get into into positions it's Jota Ooh. and now I feel like the AI or making better runs, making better challenges. Oh, what a ball, Ianacho! He's going to run onto this. Oh, and goes down. Free kick. Now, what will that be? A yellow? Please be a red. It's got to be a red. Come on, send him off, send him off, send him off. Yes! It's a red for Mark Roberts in the sixth minute. Oh, I don't know though, I don't know. <laughs> Quick sub. Alright, can we get anything of this? Carvalho's gonna whip one and he does! Make Birmingham pay! That's it! Shao Carvalho! With a powerful free kick. After that sending off of Mark Roberts. Fantastic free kick from him. Keeper. No chance. He was just scrambling to his right hand side. Look at that. Almost getting fingertips. But it wasn't meant to be. Forrest take the lead. Yeah, I have changed the uh, camera settings as well, if anyone's noticed. Um, it's now on Classic. I think the height is 20 and the zoom is 10. I, I believe... Oh! Oh! Out of nowhere! Dariqua! Wow! As I was saying, I believe you can see more of the crowd in this one. Oh my word. Osborne, though. 
Look at that for a cross and Dariqa coming in behind Iheanacho. I think the keeper was looking at Iheanacho thinking he's going to make a... He's going to take a shot, but no, Dariqa literally out of nowhere. He didn't have his eyes on him. What a goal from that guy. Goal for Nottingham Forest. Number 27, Tendai Dariqa. Tendai Dariqa. This is a message for all away supporters. Can you please remain seated after the game and your coach will meet you at the turnstile. Thank you. And there you have it. Forest have taken a 2-0 lead here against Birmingham. I didn't expect it to be so one-sided. It's Carvalho! Oh, should have been three. He should have had his second goal of the day. Just over the bar. Birmingham in dire straits at the moment. Oh. Oh, I don't know what to tell you about them. They're just... They're just very... They just look and feel very depleted. Let's see this. Carvalho. Forrest just running. Everything. Oh, Ben Osborne almost catching the keeper out there. He just watched it all the way. Oh. It's going to be a very long match for Birmingham if they carry on like this. It's Morrison. Pedersen. Crowd absolutely silent. It's Pedersen. He's going on a run for a cross. Robinson. Who else gets there? Oh, look at the run. Ben Osborne. He's going to be looking to pick. Oh, kill Diaz. Oh. Be a forest throw though. Valio. Tatsidis goes for a goal. Why not? Oh, Dariqua. He just did something to just put off the attackers there. Here comes Osborne now. Harding. See this crosses that one back to Dariqua. He did score that last goal not too long ago. Good play now. Gil Diaz. Look at this though. Carvalho playing in Ben Osborne. 3 0. Pretty much game over. Take a bow. Ben Osborne. Great build up. Just everything clicking there for Forrest. Keeper gets a touch but couldn't help but push it back into the net. Birmingham absolutely ran over today. Morrison. Birmingham just need to just need to pick themselves up. They, they haven't done anything in this match. They're just letting Forrest just dictate everything. Oh, good play there. Dariqua. Diaz. Look at the space for Tendai Dariqua. 
Oh, he thought he'd get himself another. He thought he would, but he's gone out for a corner. <laughs> Aim for Dariqua. Never gonna get to him though. Ooh! Liam Bridcut stops the attack. Tatsi Days! You know he can hit them from there, and he can score from there. I know what I've not tried for a while. The timed, timed shooting. Not tried that. Maybe there'll be a chance in this game. Maybe right now. Oh, <laughs> that was time shot. <laughs> oh, I'd have been better off just going for it as standard. Here is Pedersen. Jota finds Adams. Back to Jota again. And don't forget, they are a man down. Maybe that's why it is not really much of a challenge because they obviously they've lost a defender. gone out for a throw to Forest. Diaz. Oh, that was timed. Another Tatsidis shot over the bar. Never mind. We are 3-0 up. I mean, that right there. Terrible decision from Mark Roberts. And obviously that free kick from Carvalho leading to the first goal. Brilliant. And they they've just not given anything into this game. They don't deserve anything out of it. They've been very poor, Birmingham City. And I think a lot of the fans are leaving. I think a lot of them left at half time. Unsurprisingly, and I don't blame them. They've been poor. I'm telling Mom, good save. Carvalho. Out for a ball. Van Osborne, though. A little too slow on the attack. Kifton Beld. Pedersen. Gets it back. Back to Pedersen again. He finds Gardner. He's on a yellow card. Birmingham do have Blackburn in the next game. And if they're playing anything like this... Birmingham will run away with it. I mean, Blackburn will run away with it. For sure. Just going to need to pick themselves up after this defeat. And hopefully. Well, I don't really care. <laughs> oh, yeah, Nacho is offside. He was just setting his shot up there. Gardner is going off now. Obviously, Craig Gardner does not want another yellow. He don't want to miss the next the next game or so. And neither does his manager. Here's Jota. Dawson, amazing defending. Carvalho. Nacho finds Gil Diaz. Decent ball in though. Ooh. Diaz gets it back. He's looking for Nacho. 
Ah, oh, so close. Like Iheanacho to get himself another one. But he's, I don't think he's very happy at the club at the moment. Let's see this. Terrible shot. I don't think Iheanacho is very happy at the club. He's not getting the starts he was promised, as he says. Leave it at that. Oh, I know. Let's take off Pantillimon and put in Smith. Why not? Why not? Let's give him a little bit of a run. <laughs> On comes Jordan Smith for. Costel Pantillimon. Kushak in goal. Let's see if those changes are going to help Forrest. It's Cash. Really should have laid the pass on a little bit later. Oh. Ooh. In there, two footed and Osborne. Strequa. Iheanacho. Ben Brereton. Of course, slots it away for Forrest's fourth. Iheanacho. Amazing assist there. Defence was absolutely woeful. It was all over the place. Brereton slides it through. He's only just come on, so amazing substitute. Great tactics from Karanka. Also not finding anyone with that. And we have less possession. I mean, look at the scoreline. You don't win games from possession. It's pretty cool. Raritan. Matty Cash. Oh, look at that from here. Nacho just pushed the side. Oh, and again. People just want to take him out. A red. <laughs> A second red. Christian Pedersen on the same man that Mark Roberts tackled earlier. Kelechi Inacho. Cash. Decent ball in. Oh! And what a way to react to that. Inacho gets his goal. He gets redemption. After those two sendings, <laughs> sending off. <laughs> Look at that for a cross in. Matty Cash. Ian Acho on the volley. Wasn't stopping that. Kushak. Great finish. Birmingham nil. Forest goal. Number 13, Forest five. And they are just down to nine men. That's why it's been such a walk all over. Like, I've just walked all over them today. Brereton. Iheanacho! <sighs> Absolute pounding of Birmingham. At home as well. Iheanacho grabs his second. Brereton assist. Really expect him getting that though from that tight angle. This will be a better view of it. 
Oof. Smashed it. Goal for Nottingham Forest. Number 13, Kalechi Anaccio. It's Birmingham nil. Forest six. The nine men of Birmingham. I mean, they never really got into it. After that sending off, I think that that's what made them just go to pop, really. It's pretty much all over here. It's been over since half time. Let's just put it that way. Harding to Kifton Beld. Magoma. Cash. Finds Dariqua. Here's Tendai Dariqua. Look at the sprint of this guy, though. Lays that one off for Matty Cash. Oh. Brereton. Ooh. Good save this time. Actually makes a save. Kushak. That's a good shot from Brereton, though. Well done. Tatsidis! Almost. Almost Tatsidis. Actually, no, nowhere near. <laughs> nowhere near at all. Kushak is just sick of balls coming his way. He's just had balls left, right and centre today. Thrown at him. Well, kicked at him. And that's it. Game is well and truly over. And Birmingham... What a long day it was for them. Birmingham nil. Forest six. Soon as Roberts got sent off though, they just they just absolutely just just couldn't get get back up they just couldn't capitalize on anything it just took all the wind out of them and Dariqua with that second after that first goal it was like oh they got sending off then they've got a goal down and then it was just like oh no and then they went pretty much straight after four minutes after they went two nil down thanks for that Tendai Dariqua goal and then not too long after Osborne came up with this 3-0 pretty much all but over Carvalho with a great assist though 3-0 it's game over there and then 32nd minute and that waited until the 70th minute it's Ben Brereton assist from Iheanacho slots away the 4th cool as you like after just coming on. He's been a great player though. After coming back from off loan. And Ianacho, six minutes after, after the second sending off of Pedersen, Ianacho gets his redemption after both of those tackles on him led to a sending off. But he was happy enough to pick up his volleyed goal. And that made it five. And the last goal again. Iheanacho passed from Brereton. Unlikely of angles. But he made it work. And he smashed it. Brereton with the assist. Both of them two linking up very well. And that, at the end of the day, is what did Birmingham. Two shots from them. Very poor, very poor performance from Birmingham City.
So we still have a game in hand. We're 11 points clear. That's crazy. Derby in the next game. Oof. The Derby again. We obviously did win it last time. Only from a goal to nil from Carvalho. If I remember. He's going to have to play. I, I need him to be happy. I need him to be happy at the club. Um, so, yeah. He's, he's got to play. Yeah, Nacho. Right, if you've enjoyed this episode, which I, I hope you guys have. Um, we did get a replay against Bolton. Last, last minute of the game. Very tense. Um, and then an absolute smashing of Birmingham. Six goals to nil. Yeah. I've I've loved this episode. It's been full of goals, full of just the tense match against Bolton was absolutely incredible. But to come back was amazing. So yeah, I hope you guys have liked this episode. Make sure to subscribe if you're new, if you want to see more. And yeah, I'll catch you in the next video. I'm really looking forward to it. Have a great day. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye for now, guys.